crunch time for the Prime Minister, who must decide this week whether Plan B measures need to change. Whichever path he chooses, it's clear Boris Johnson won't please everyone. Would you like to see further restrictions come in now? Yes, absolutely. I think the numbers are way too high. We're starting to confuse testing with uh, severity of a disease. Um, and I wish they'd stop testing people, because if we just got on with life, we'd soon be back to normal. But it's the tests which are providing one of the key indicators, hitting over 100,000 positive results for three days in a row leading up to Christmas. Figures weren't released over the holiday weekend but are expected to reach new highs when they're outlined later today. Scientists warn the time for action is now. We're in a little bit of a black hole at the moment because we don't know what's happened over the last two days. An argument for restrictions would be to be able to flatten this curve of cases a little bit to enable um, the hospitals and the NHS and the services um, to be maintained. Soaring cases, enough to scare the Scottish government into toughening up restrictions there. No white Christmas this year, this and other theatre shows now closed for weeks. In Northern Ireland, there are further restrictions on hospitality from today, as well as renewed social distancing rules. Testing times in Wales too. A return to social distancing and one-way systems among new measures there, and nightclubs are closed. In England, this was the scene last night, open and desperate to stay so the Covid passport situation, which we saw in Wales, Scotland and Northern Ireland initially being uh, administered, uh, that was led to be, uh, it was supposed to be a mitigation that would allow nightclubs to remain open. That clearly hasn't happened. Today, Boris Johnson is expected to examine the latest hospital data before making a decision. Encouraging signs there and England could be saved from toughened new rules. But if the figures suggest concern for the NHS, the Prime Minister may find himself caught between scientific advice and backbench reluctance to support new measures. Sadia Chowdhury, Sky News.